we are living through uh, one of these historic defining times. You have to approach these things a little bit differently. It requires more diplomacy. It requires more dialogue. It requires more respect for people, more mutual interest. We've got work to do on income disparity, and I think people want to see not only that they have a job, they want to have more confidence in the job that they've got, and they want to have confidence that their incomes are growing. You know, we, we claim we have a job shortage in this country. That's not true. We have a skill shortage. I think what is refreshing about some of the uh, new media ventures that we've seen is that there is sort of a return to real news. There's a changing of the guard every generation in media, and we're the changing of the guard for Gen Y. When I came to the U.S., I, I found myself taking on a new identity. Or no, rather, I found an, a new identity thrust upon me. Thrust upon you here. I became black in America. It's how do you hack? How do you modify? How do you take something that serves one purpose and make it apply to something else so it accomplishes a fundamental social need? It is critical that over the long term we take from this experience the lesson that we have to build for the future. This country is always trying to become more perfect, trying to become better. 